So uh, you want to just tell everybody how you're doing and what's going on? Um, well, I miss you guys, you know. I really miss you guys, you know. I miss everything about you guys. But um, away from that, I'm okay. I'm healthy. Everybody, everybody is okay so far, you know. You know, just here, you know, trying to live and trying to make it, you know. So I think good so far. We just, we just, we, we miss you guys, you know. And you know, I think about you guys every day. Yeah. But you know, I, I miss you guys, you know. And I, I, I love you guys so much, you know. But it's hard to not. You guys can't come. Kind of bored. We are bored sometimes, you know, by not having you guys here. You know, very frustrating, you know. But that's just life. You know, life goes on. You know. And that, I think, is, um, to me, anyway, that's inspirational. Life does go on, and, and um, but it's hard sometimes. So I have everybody on mute so they can't all yell at the same time that they miss you. But you know they yeah. do. Yeah, I can't mean to encourage people to empower people to, you know, to spread the love among people. From my experience, you know, but it's, I know and I'm happy that I am able to touch a lot of people not here, but all over the world, you know, and I continue to do that, you know, with, with, with God's help, you know. I, you know, I appreciate it and thank you guys very much, you know, for caring and thinking about me and loving me, you know. I, I appreciate it. Thank you guys so much. Thanks, Lincoln. Thank you, Thank you for being here. Brother Richard, I think, um, could you tell how you were first introduced to Mustard Seed? I think it was a um, like a church camp, wasn't it? It was a youth camp. Yeah, we came here about nine years ago, almost 10 years ago, on a camp. And it was just for four days as it started. But then, like previous years, it went to a week because we loved it so much. So it was first for four days, and you would come, you would work with the caregivers, you'd feed the, the, the residents, but you'd also have the spiritual side of things and like the time to think about the way you spent your day with the residents. And so I think that really, that's what, that, that was a seed planted. Hey, Mark. Hey, Mark. <laughs> I think he's talking to you, Mark Cray. Yeah, he is. Hi, Lincoln. How are you doing? I'm okay. That's great. Good, to, Good see to see you. Good to see you too. Richard, how's um, anything that you have to add about like the, one of the things I think is important to point out that I'll say is that Jamaica really has almost no uh, vocations for the priesthood coming from that country. And so um, you are um, really, you're the only Jamaican in formation for mustard seed and that um, even Father Garvin and Monsignor Gregory aren't Jamaican. Yeah, it's, it's frightening, but I guess you just have to take it. As Father Garvin always says, it was everything in life is a learning experience. And that's why I'm thinking of it. But it's very frightening. I don't know why, but God will do his work. <laughs> and, um, and how old are you, if you don't mind my asking? I am 22 years old. <laughs> yeah, he's a lot younger than you, Lincoln. <laughs> yeah, he is. A lot. So far. Yeah. Oh, boy. He still has a lot to share with me. Yeah. I'm going to teach him. Yes. I hope so. Yes, I will. And, and Lincoln, just all of your friends there and all of our friends yeah. there, just, just let them know how much they're missed and loved. And I mean, everybody loves you, but it's not just you. I know, I know, I know, I know, I know, I know that, I know. You have to share it. Everybody, 
All right. Thank you. Thank you for taking the time to be here today. We really appreciate it. Okay, made, guys. Thank I think, you. I think you made a lot of people's days. Yeah. Love you, Lincoln. Thanks.